Hi everyone, my name is Etani Priscilla and in this video I'm going to be talking about a plant called Lithops marmorata, otherwise known as the stone plant or the pebble plant. I'm going to be explaining this plant in a tender profile like manner and be talking on behalf of the plant in order to make it more appealing to other plants that might want to date it. Hi, my name is Cletus Mamorata. I'm 21 years old. And the first picture is a picture that's just a very correct visual representation of myself. I'm made up of two bulbous leaves growing on the opposite side, and I have a flower growing in between those bulbous leaves. The bulbous leaves are what give me my defining features or my defining name, which is stone or pebbles. This is because the bubble sleeves look like stones and pebbles, and this is not in vain. This is actually what helps keep me alive from generation to generation. The bubble sleeves serve as an adaptive feature for me because I normally grow in hot environments surrounded by rocks. It gives me a rock-like appearance that helps me blend in with other rocks and this helped me, this protects me against predators and make me live longer, obviously. And then I have my second picture, is the picture of my second favorite place, which is a hot, quiet desert. So I'm here in the desert chilling, and I love the desert because there is no rain. I do not like rain at all. So much rain can actually lead to my death. So I prefer sunlight where I can just take it in, make my food, and just keep living my my best life. Um, the third picture is my first favorite place to be in, which is in a pot plant with other um, stone plants. I love this because, as you can see, if you look closely in, to, in the um, pots, you can see that there's no much soil and there's no much moisture. It's just the rocks, and that is what I love. That is what I love, and I use it to grow. About myself, I'm really low budget. That is one thing you should know about me. I don't use a lot of water. You don't need to care for me. You just need to leave me under the sun. Um, my favorite place to be is, is in Africa, hot regions majorly, and that's why I find myself in Africa. I'm found in Angola, um, South Africa, where there's hot, um, where there's sun, like most times of the year, and I love to thrive in this areas because I don't have to be scared of rain. What do I like to eat? The second picture is exactly what I love to eat, which is sun. I like to take in sun and then make glucose for myself. And that is really the best food, something that you make by yourself. How I reproduce? I reproduce in two ways. I reproduce by seed or by propagation. I replace it by seeds whereby I can just be planted. I don't need a lot of water to grow. I can just be planted. And one negative thing about me being grown by seed is that it takes me a really long time to germinate. It can take me from three weeks to a month to germinate. And that is why people get impatient and result to propagation. Propagation is just basically planting me from my parents. So in this case, a part of my parents can be cut out and then plant it in a different area and I can just start growing from there. And it's, I'm really simple, I just start germinating. So yeah, that's all you should know about me. I don't like the sun too much. I can grow, I can go for a very long period of time without sun. I'm so low budget and I have a very cool adaptive feature that even defines me. So I hope you find me interesting and hopefully you swipe right. Thank you.